mind. We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon. Ten, nine, ignition sequence start. Six, five, four, three, two, one. talk more about uh, what it takes to become a multi-planet species. This is the updated design for the, the what we, we're sort of searching for the right name, but the code name at least is BFR. Um, BFR in a fully reusable configuration without any orbital refueling, we expect to have a payload capability of 150 tons to low with orbit. Now for today's test, we will be uh, the first of many as we work towards transitioning Starship from a developmental into an operational program. Aerodynamic Everybody, welcome back to the channel. Just before the big announcement, can I ask you a quick favour? I stood here about nine months ago and announced to literally my parents that I was going to start a YouTube channel and it was going to be about rockets and electric cars mainly. Since then, over 70,000 people have watched this channel, over 4,000 hours of watch time. So if I can ask you a favour, if you have watched this channel and you have enjoyed it, please consider subscribing because it really helps get that channel out there. So now to the announcement. Tomorrow I'm going to head off to Texas to watch my first ever live rocket launch. Not just any rocket, but the Starship. Twice the size of the rocket that took men to the moon. The biggest rocket ever launched. So this is the second test flight. I'll be arriving 
and hopefully we're giving you a little bit of behind the scenes go and visit the launch site before the rocket goes and after that I'm going to spend at least a couple of weeks doing 2,000 miles or more of EV driving I'm going to visit Austin to go to Giga Texas see if I can find myself a Cybertruck anyway hopefully you'll find time to follow some of my short videos I'm going to make and if you do want to keep informed, remember to hit the bell icon. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you soon.